July, this is Mark Pledger, and it's a, definitely a case of Christmas in July. Not only have I just bought myself a Victrix Scorpio 338 Lapua, I've also acquired a brand spanking new Victrix Gladius 6.5 Creedmoor. I've developed a load, I must admit this is my first load that I'm actually trying out today, so when you're filming it's not necessarily good to try out something new, but we're going to be doing something slightly different today, and this is more talking about the accessories and why it's so important to buy good quality from the word go. So the nice thing is that the manufacturers of the Victrix rifle, which is an exceptionally good rifle, have now also started manufacturing a full range of accessories. So today I'm shooting uh, the new Rome bipods and the name of the company is Rutini Officiana Mechanica, hence the name Rome. Um, so I'm shooting uh, their bipods which are exceptionally good, the best bipods that I've ever used and the nice thing about them they're really easy you have you will see some of the videos that I've done on the accessory range so please go and have a look and you can get some more information but also what I'm shooting today is the Rome monoblock uh, scope mount this is the hinged version which I think is absolutely brilliant again I've got some videos on that but as you noted, this is a quick release uh, outfit. So what we're going to have a look at is we're going to hopefully zero the rifle at 100 meters or we're going to take a shot at 100 meters, see where it prints. We're going to take the scope off, we're going to put it back on uh, and let's see that we actually get it in the exact same place again. And that's the benefit of normally buying a much better quality scope. You know that the tolerances in building this is absolutely perfect. So as long as you don't have any user problems, you should be able to repeat uh, your shots day in, day out by taking your scope or putting it back on and so forth. Okay, so let's give it a bash. They say the proof is in the pudding. Let's see how we go. Okay, we're just off center there, no excuses, let's see that we can do it again. The gun is safe, we've got the nice little quick release system, so we just open the two levers and now we can remove the scope. On the system itself, you tighten it up to fit your Picatinny rail, it's a piece of pie to do, and that's by simply adjusting those necessary screws there to get the correct tension, and also when you clip it in, you'll notice you've got a, a little locking point there. So you've got a positive lock when you uh, lock it onto your Picatinny rail and you know that it can't come off or, uh, by bumping and knocking. So we pop it back onto the same place on the Picatinny rail. We lock it into place. Eyes and ear protection. Much easier if we are loading through the magazine, but let's see. So, the nice thing about having or investing in in good equipment, be it your bullets, your cases, your firearm, and your firearm accessories, by having the correct items uh, in place. Maybe what what's the famous saying: "Buy once, cry once." You buy the correct product and shooting becomes an absolute pleasure. You can chop, change, and as soon as you put everything back to where it's supposed to be, your gun will shoot in the exact same place. 